So let me give you an example. In COVID, during the pandemic recession, we were all very mindful of the need to access food. And if you think about who produces food, who processes food, who distributes food, who prepares food, a large share of people in the food value chain are informally employed. So when we think of food and the food value chain, we have a variety of work arrangements. We have gig workers who are distributing food on bicycles or motorcycles, but we have large conglomerates who are processing food. We have small farm producers. We have big commercial farms. And the conglomerates often hire workers informally, and the big farmers, the com big commercial farms, often contract farmers informally. So there's informality up and down the food chain. So th the top brands are rife with informal employment down their own value chains. A lot of work is outsourced from large brand firms down value chains to people in factories who are hired informally and also a large share of people who work from their own homes for export industries doing ancillary work or even the primary work of production.